Astronus has a sole focus on designing, building, and operating small satellites at high orbits. And we think that same focus is directly applicable to the national security community as they are reinventing their architectures to embrace commercial space. So there's a lot of companies out there, a lot of them are traditional defense contractors. They're focused on satellites, airplanes, missiles, submarines. I think we're different than that. We're focusing from the ground up at small satellites with the latest in technology. The government's looking for a quick evolution evolutionary changes to GEO, and that's one of the things we've been trying to address with our smaller satellites. Before I joined Astronus, I spent many years at the NRO operating national technical means satellites, supporting warfighters around the world. Coming from a traditional defense contractor, which I've worked at for many years, it's just like super refreshing to come to this company and seeing our engineers truly innovate. I've worked in legacy geospace for over 20 years, and one of the things about Astronus that amazes me is how quickly we can iterate on a tightly coupled system. We are so vertically aligned within the company that allows us to make changes to hardware, test that change and fly it within two year span that we wouldn't be able to do in Legacy Geo in 15. What brought me to Astronus was the opportunity to work in a highly innovative, state-of-the-art company that is developing proliferated, small, maneuverable assets at higher orbits. And this is something that I believe that the community has needed to embrace for a very long time. The government's traditional communication satellites are in Geo. But as we know, those satellites have become big, juicy targets as space has become a contested environment. By building small, highly maneuverable geos, we can avoid those vulnerabilities and bring capability to the warfighter at a much faster pace. We can also do it at a price point that is much, much lower than what the DoD has traditionally had to pay. At Astronus, our answer for resilience is proliferation in geo. One of the key concepts with the recent trend to go into low Earth orbit was proliferating assets, high numbers of satellites, so that no one single satellite jeopardizes your mission. And what we've seen is the emergence of counter space threats that are now jeopardizing even the viability of proliferated LEO constellations in the future. So the idea that you need to take that proliferation concept and bring it to other orbits becomes critical. The key aspect about Astronus that makes us an attractive partner with the government is that we have a very viable commercial business. We've raised over $750 million from our investors. We have over a billion dollar backlog of commercial sales. So the same satellites we are building for the commercial market today are directly portable to the national security community. We are years ahead of where industry would be otherwise, and we want to directly apply that to help the community today.